congratulations on signing the 17th relationship in, in the Houston Sister Cities uh, uh, family. But more important, this is the 100th Muslim city in the Sister City Network. This is a mom momentum that we wanted to maintain. It's entirely supported by Sister Cities International and the State Department. So congratulations. Uh, we support your efforts. Uh, we support your insight. Sister Cities International is here as your association and exists to support you. Houston is a leader in using citizen diplomacy as a tool for peace, exchange, and economic relations. I heard Mayor Kamal talk last night about eliminating the cosmetics and getting to the hard work. And believe me, I, I believe you're going to get it done, sir. I believe you do. And we, we will we'll support you entirely. I just want you to remember several things. One, all the important work is done at your level. This is where the rubber meets the road. And the work you do is very, very important in the world today. Thank you for including me in this ceremony. I appreciate it. Now, uh, one person which don't, doesn't need any introduction to you all, the greatest mayor America has ever seen, Mayor Bill White of Houston. <laughs> Mayor Kamal, uh, we honor you. We thank you for your visit. We honor you as a representative of the many millions of people in Karachi, one of the world's great cities. This is an important time for both Houston and for Karachi. Uh, the mayor, uh, whether it be the mayor of Houston or the mayor of Karachi, uh, we are accountable to people in the residents of our community to those things that are most basic within those communities. Often it's a challenging task. The role of local government and uh, neighborhood-based government and, uh, well, a whole range of services that are provided at the municipal level is something that transcends the changes of leadership at the top of the country and it's the things that affect the quality of life of our residents and for people to know each other and for our kids and grandkids to be think of themselves not just as citizens of the nation of their citizenship but also as citizens of a world requires that we understand other cities and other cultures and the sister city relationship embodies that on my own part i spent time significant amounts of time in different parts of my life in karachi as a young man as a senior government official, I've seen many different parts of Karachi, Mr. Mayor. And uh, Karachi and Houston have a fair amount in common. Uh, we're both port cities that have a vital trade status for our respective countries. Uh, we're both cities where there's many hardworking people, and most of the people in both of our cities have arrived with, within one or two generations. Many Houstonians, like many in Karachi, I came off the land just looking for opportunity within an urban setting. They're dynamic cities where if you haven't visited for 10 or 20 years and you go back, then you wonder, uh, then you are in awe of everything that has changed. Uh, and I could go on for uh, many more. They are key cities in the economics, uh, in, in the, the economies of their region. and. One thing I look forward to is creating the relationships so that there will be economic opportunities for those within our respective cities and they can get to know people as you can only know them if you have spent extended period of time and, and, and spend that time with each other. Our experience with the sister city relationship for those people who are engaged in the sister city relationship has been very good in large part it is not dependent on, at least on our part, uh, those within city government. Although, like with Councilman Rakan and I and others are very supportive of the sister city relationship. It depends on the willingness of citizens to be involved and to take it on themselves to organize educational, cultural, and other activities that can promote uh, some exchange and understanding between these two cities. We this is if anything, a vehicle into which the energies of our respective citizens and residents can be poured. <coughs> Mr. Mayor, 
We are very proud, especially, of our broad and deep Pakistani American community uh, within this great region. You see in the people here so many people who are not simply leaders in the Pakistani American community, but they are our civic leaders. I've spotted members, um, important boards, judges, and others who have stepped up to serve the people in this region in positions of great honor. You see entrepreneurs, you see engineers, doctors, lawyers, and other professionals. You see small business people who've taken small businesses and make them, them into things which are larger businesses. Uh, and I think you see people who are observant in their faith and who've helped us uh, change uh, attain an awareness of the need for an understanding and that faithful people from all traditions have much more in common than those who do not understand the role of a higher power in each of our lives. So I want to applaud the work of those uh, council member and especially Mr. Mayor who have worked so hard. There are so many individuals that have worked so that we could come to this day that I won't attempt to list the names who are involved. I want you to know who you are. Uh, this is not a matter of uh, rivalry or credit. It's really a credit, not so much, I would say, if it's not presumptuous, Mr. Mayor, of either Mayor Kamal or myself. It is the work of uh, the citizens of each of our communities that have put in the effort uh, to bring this together. And as we inaugurate this moment and take pictures, then the real success will be 20 years from now, when people could say that they were there at the beginning of the sister city relationship and they can look back upon what we've been able to accomplish together. Thank you very much. I request uh, the one of the top mayors in the world, Mayor Mustafa Kamal of Karachi. Well, thank you very much, Mayor Bill White, uh, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, the member of council, <coughs> huge number of uh, people from the media, print media and electronics media to everybody, all the August gathering. Very good afternoon to all of you, and assalamu alaikum. Well, it's indeed a, a great historical <coughs> moment which we are witnessing right now, and I must say that uh, it would not have been possible if the mayor office, mayor himself, his team had not taken all these initiatives and persuaded this whole thing. We would not be witnessing otherwise today this historical moment. So on behalf of the people of Karachi, 18 million people of Karachi, and on behalf of the all districts of Pakistan, I must say, on behalf of the people of Pakistan, because Karachi is the face of Pakistan. So on behalf of the people of Pakistan, I must thank, sir, uh, Mr. Mayor, I must thank you and thank the whole team and thank the people of Houston here in, uh, in, in this moment for bringing us and giving us this chance to, uh, to uh, get uh, engaged formally today. And uh, we are going to have this uh, moment very soon, and we are witnessing this moment. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, let me just uh, uh, tell you my underlying feeling today and give you some ideas behind it that why have we been very keen and why we have been very proactive and what is important for today's date for us as a Karachiite and as mayor of Karachi uh, belongs to a party called MQM, a Hakparas uh, group. What is the importance today for me? Let me just tell you that Karachi is the face of Pakistan. And Karachi is the biggest city of the Muslim Ummah, ladies and gentlemen. And today, we are the biggest victim, Pakistan, as well as the whole Muslim Ummah. The, we are the biggest victim of our bad perception, our marketing in all over the world from the Muslim community as well as the Pakistan 